Hello, my name is Kelly Mena, and today I'll be presenting my project, The Frog's Anatomy. I have chosen 10 different organs that I want to display on my project. The first one is the nictating membrane. The nictating membrane is a transparent part of a frog's lower eyelid that moves over the eye to clean it and protect it. The location of the nictating membrane is uh, inside the frog's eye. Next, we have the tympanic membrane. The tympanic membrane is basically the eardrum of the frog. It receives sound waves and it also allows the frog to hear both in air and below the water. As you can see, this circular patch of skin that is behind the eye is where the tympanic membrane can be found. Next, we have the tongue. The tongue is a muscular structure attached to the front of the mouth, which is extended to catch insects, which is its food. The location of the tongue can be in, found inside of the mouth. Fun fact, frogs' tongues are attached to the front of their mouths rather than the back, like us humans. Next, we have the vomerine teeth. The vomerine teeth are small projections in the top of the frog's mouth that function in holding a captured prey. The location uh, is inside of the tops, uh, I mean, inside the top of the frog's mouth. As you can see, those two dots are the vomerine teeth. Next, we have the maxillary teeth. The maxillary teeth are a sharp, are a sharp teeth in the maxilla of a frog's mouth that function in holding a captured prey, just like the vomerine teeth. Uh, the location of the maxillary teeth is inside of the mouth in the upper edge of the jaws. Next, we have the glottis. The glottis is an opening from the mouth into the respiratory system. It serves as an opening into the lungs. As you can see, that hole is the glottis. Um, the glottis can be found at the back of the oral cavity. Uh, next, we have the vocal sacs. The vocal sac is the flexible membrane of skin possessed by most male frogs. The purpose of the vocal sac is usually used as an amplification of their mating or advertising call. Uh, the location of the vocal sac is in the floor of the mouth slash the vocal cavity. Right here, we have the spleen. The spleen is an organ in the frog's circulatory system that makes, stores, and destroys blood cells. The location of the spleen can be found under the small intestine. As you can see, that little black thing is the spleen. Now, right here, we have the small intestine. The small intestine is the principal organ of digestion and absorption of digested food. Uh, it can be found in the frog's digestive system. As you can see, this large sausage-looking organ is the large intestine, and the small curly tubes is the small intestine. Uh, last, we have the truncus arteriosus. The truncus arteriosus is a large artery in the frog that carries blood away from the ventricle into the branches that lead to all parts of the body. So it basically takes the blood and sparses it out the body, like spreads it out throughout the whole frog's body. Uh, it can be found in the frog's heart. As you can see, that large artery is the truncus arteriosus. Well, thank you for watching my project. Bye-bye. Uh,